So it's about 73 degrees out and I'm sitting in my truck and I'm wondering, why am I so hot? Why am I about to start sweating? Yesterday it got pretty chilly and I forgot that I had my heater on. What is up? It's your boy and you're bringing to you guys a brand new freaking video, man. So look, listen, today, today we got an exciting one. Today I got an interesting one. Today I have one I think you will agree with. So a lot of the time when I make my videos, I'm like, okay, I'm making videos every day. At least make them enjoyable. At least I enjoy them and I agree with them. But most of the time in the comment section, you let me know I'm absolutely crazy. I'm absolutely making no sense at all. But today, I think I got a good one. I, I think this may be a gem. I think you'll agree. We're going to be talking about will the Tacoma ever stop holding its value? In life, whatever goes up must come down. And the Tacomas, the Tundras, the Land Cruisers, all of Toyota trucks hold their value so, so well. But eventually they're not going to hold their value so so well and that's what we're talking about in today's video if you're at all interested please leave a like a comment and a subscription but without further ado let's get right into the video so the reason i say you'll agree with me in this video is because i'm going to be saying don't sell your third generation tacoma i think this generation tacoma is the one you're going to want to hold on to for as long as possible the proof is in the pudding i can already see the next generation tacoma being redesigned revealed and absolutely obliterated but of course i wouldn't want that like i said the proof is in the pudding you can't deny it so i'm going to talk about three things that i think will absolutely kill the value of the next generation tacoma and bring this one up if not at least keep it steady steady is okay starting off with number one the number one reason i think the next generation tacoma is going to start plummeting in value and what i mean by that is this tacoma Let's say, for example, I bought it for 40000 In two years, I can go trade it in for 35000 But let's say you buy the next generation Tacoma for 40000 Maybe it'll be worth 30000 That's my assumption. Obviously, that's a bit of an exaggeration, but just so you know where I'm at. Now, the number one thing that I think that is going to ruin the next generation Tacoma is the engine. Now, this Tacoma, it's a V6. It puts out 278 horsepower, which isn't too, too bad. I enjoy it. I think it's just right. But if you remember, the previous Tacoma, the second gen, had a 4.0 V6. Now, everybody hated it. Why would you take out the 4.0? And I think if the 4.0 had the same modern features that this Tacoma has, more people would buy the 4.0 because if i could i would get the 4.0 i don't know if you've driven a second generation tacoma if you haven't it's no race car but it definitely has more umph than this one so yeah i think the beginning of the fall off on the next generation tacoma will have to do with the engine if the engine is not bigger which it's not going to be if the engine does not outperform which it may if the next engine does not outlast which it probably won't then people aren't going to be holding on to them as long, meaning the value is going to be less because there's going to be so many coming in. Supply and demand, it's easy to understand, but it's not what we want to agree with. Number two, the number two thing that I want to talk about is a redesign fail. Let's say they redesigned this Tacoma right, and it does just as good as its older brother did. Now, if you don't know, that was sarcasm. If you don't know, the new Tundra, well, how do I... How do I say this? It's uh, not doing too well, okay? It's not doing too well. Not a lot of people like it. And if not a lot of people like it, Toyota would just kill it off and not make it anymore. So I think if Toyota does the same thing, they reveal it, if they hype us up for 10 years that they're gonna come out with a new truck and then they give us a smaller engine, a different transmission, an interior that isn't appealing to everybody. There's not one thing that is appealing to everybody, but something that, well, we can meet in the middle I think that's where we're gonna run into some issues. But yeah, that's the second thing. I think if Toyota drops the ball on the redesign, then it's just gonna add to this problem that won't be fun. And last, last but not least, the amount of modifications that you're gonna be able to do to this truck just aren't gonna be there. It's not gonna be the same as of right now. I could go on to Google and look up Toyota Tacoma suspension lift kit, and I will have literally more suspension lift kits than I have subscribers including all brands and all variations there is plenty of lift kits plenty of variations of lift kits it's going to be absurd you're not going to have the chance to change your headlights your fog lights your grill it's going to take some time for companies to get modifications out give us what we want and actually be good and actually fit properly it takes a lot of time for companies to actually make these so what do you think am i crazy do you think that for once i've made a good video i think i've hit the nail 
on the head this time we're keeping this tacoma and compare it to the next trucks and the next trucks and the next trucks if not just keep it as my daily but nonetheless i definitely think this will be one of the last toyota tacomas that is going to be remembered and appreciated and so many adventures were had in these trucks so many adventures are to come in this truck and i don't know if the next generation tacoma will be able to hold up to the value to the reliability to the dependability that this truck has set this truck shows that it can do so i'm interested let me know what do you guys think if the next generation toyota tacoma comes out and you don't like it are you going to end up stepping out of your third gen just to say you have a newer truck? Or are you going to keep this Tacoma until the wheels fall off? I'm really considering keeping this one, especially for that very, very beautiful blue. Nonetheless, it's been your boy. I'm out of like an Audi. I'll see you tomorrow. Single tomorrow. Peace.